Welcome ladies and gentlemen and everyone in between and off the spectrum. My name is Prince Katsune and today I'm back with another episode of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Now, things have been getting a little bit more complicated, at least when it comes to military corruption. Roy and the boys, our boys, Ed and L, and Winry, I guess not one of the boys, but she is one of the people. <laughs> She's one of our boys. Uh, yeah, they're in a pretty bad situation. I mean, we found out the Sins learned a few different things. One, they learned that Roy is onto them, specifically that he's doing some internal investigating. And two, we learned that Lust is already on the case, pretending to date that one guy within Roy's circle, whose name I don't remember, and uh, supposedly is hemorrhaging information out of him as well. The boys are still dealing with realizing that uh, Hughes is dead, which Hughes has already gotten killed because of aforementioned corruption. He was doing the same thing that Roy is doing. Roy is picking up where he left off, so uh, it's not a good look for Roy. We already have what's her face maria getting singled out and targeted for being supposedly related to the hughes thing i don't think that's the case i think she's just another scapegoat another message to send to roy to like hey stop digging it's only going to turn out poorly for the people around you as if hughes wasn't enough i'm worried about what's going to happen to maria next anyway if you're new here or if you've been here before this is the part of the video where i ask you to hit all the buttons you know the ones the youtube buttons the like comment subscribe buttons and the bell as well if you wish I'd appreciate it a lot. It really lets me know how you guys are actually feeling about what I'm doing. It's very important to get that feedback. That being said, honestly, I just want to jump into the episode. Let's just do it. All right, we got the skylight. <laughs> What's going on here? Hmm. That's not a good. She's been interrogated. <laughs> Um, they have the bullet. Whoa, 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 whoa. Close enough that even a woman could have done it. I read that right, right? That's what he said. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Only women can only hit short range. What does that mean? That's so fucking stupid. I fucking hate this guy. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> women are incapable of marksmanship. Marksmanship? Did I say that wrong? Whatever. <laughs> I think I just learned over it a little bit. <laughs> Even though today is not a Wednesday, White Cloud Wednesday has begun a little bit early. <laughs> I'm already drinking one. You can guess what flavor it is if you want. I have the tequila smash ones now. I don't know how this conversation went from <laughs> misogyny to, to drinking White Claws. I guess those things can be pretty closely related if you really think about it. <laughs> but yeah, I have the tequila smash ones now. Uh, I'm just, just trying this first one. If you want to guess what it is, by all means, go ahead and comment it. I don't care. Or if you want to comment about the atrocity that we just witnessed. Um, in defense of women, then yeah, please comment that as well. <laughs> Even a woman could have done it. Jesus Christ. Don't they all have the same gun? Isn't that standard issue? I would imagine. Sure. Yeah, she gets ammo for her gun. When did she fire? Yeah, 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 she did do that. I remember. I was there. Yeah, it was a secret mission, dumbass. It was not unmanned. There were several people there. So you claim. By the way, by the way, she's not the only person that claims this. There were four other people there. Actually, three other people. The other handler, whose name I forget, and then Ed and Al. Who are trustworthy as hell. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, because someone destroyed it. They cover up the tracks because there's some stuff going on there. God, you're so stupid. Yeah. There was something going on there and then someone blew it up to cover their tracks. How hard is that to believe? Envy was using her image, right? Wasn't he? 
But then she was witnessed there anyway. Uh-oh. That does suck, by the way, if that's the reason that she gets tied. Literally, the only reason she gets tied to this is because Envy pretended to be her for like two seconds. That's fucked. That sucks. That fucking sucks. Um, I guess that makes sense. Because your family is just going to say that she was there. Hmm. He doesn't buy this shit. He's got to know. Something's up. Rosh. Like Josh with a bruh. Truth is, yeah, he also fired a shot there. Yeah. Of course, it's being ignored because they don't, like I said, they don't care about the truth. They're just painting a picture, right? They're just trying to get her to, be get, to become the scapegoat. That's the whole idea. Yeah. Obviously. Granted, I mean, he doesn't know everything that I know, but, like, that is good that that's where his mind went. Hold flame. That's, a uh, oxymoron. Hey, Winry. That's how I feel every time she shows up. I'm just like, hey, how you doing? <laughs> what are they going to do now? Hmm. There's no good answer to that question, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> don't don't remind me about that, dude. That was so that was the saddest fucking thing. That made me so sad. <laughs> Ugh. He's asking her for help? Like advice? <laughs> I know, that's what I was going to say. I was like, he always just does what she, he wants despite everything that she tells him. He's never straight up asked her for her help. Usually she just tries to offer it because she knows she, he's never going to ask for it. And then he may or may not take it, right? But that's why she has to do it or else, you know, because he, he may take it. He might take her advice. The only way he's going to do that, though, is if she just opens her mouth, right? So, yeah, this... Honestly, for a second, I wondered if he was just asking that rhetorically <laughs> or if he was actually asking for help. And I think that's the that was the hesitation that she had to like, wait, you're serious? You're actually asking me for help? <laughs> I thought you were just being rhetorical. Hmm. <laughs> was? Yeah。そう思ったらすごく怖くなった。I mean that would probably be the most devastating thing that could happen to her right now. Yeah. They're the people she cares about most in the world, like period. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, selflessly, that makes sense. Yeah. Oh. I don't want to interrupt her, but I have thoughts. Because remember, that's what Al, Al said last time. He says, I don't want to get my body back if this is the cost, right? So we're just seeing that theme repeated again. <laughs> Shout out to Al, just kind of like diffusing the tension just a little bit. <laughs> Al is so like, he's so like empathetic to a degree, you know, like I talk about this a lot with Ed, how he's just kind of like, He's an intellectual, sure, but he's, like, not in tune with emotions and other people very well. But Ed, or Al, Jesus Christ, Al is the one who is, like, super, super understanding and, like, really just relates to people super hard. So 
I think he was just like, let's just lower the tension a little bit. Let's just ease everybody's minds. Ooh, another chessboard. Ah, I can't see anything. Damn. I wanted to see the chess position to see if there's anything fucked up. Hmm. Okay. Mm. Ah, okay. I was gonna say, I'm like, it must have been her, right? She must have been the male. M male? Male? New? News? News? What was I trying to say? What the fuck word was I trying to say there? Male? <laughs> he was not in the mail. I meant news, I guess. I don't know. It's been a long day, long week. I'm exhausted. <laughs> I just thought that sitting back and just watching a nice little episode of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, I thought that would be good for me, but I guess I was wrong. I guess I was wrong. Oh, yeah, yeah, he remembers. He's the one... Whoa, wait, 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 wait. He's the one that she shot at. <laughs> so he actually might be able to confirm her innocence. I don't know why he would do that. Maybe in exchange for his own escape. Perhaps. Yeah, who knows? We'll see. That's my hope anyway. I don't know if that's actually going to happen. Homunculi. Hmm, that was really quick. <laughs> that really, I was literally, I was just looking at the spinning ceiling fan and I was just remembering that episode earlier on where the fan was just kind of like in the room. As they were like ruminating on stuff, right? And I was like, oh, that's a callback to that same symbol, right? Of the fan just kind of spinning in circles slowly, 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 like to symbolize Ed's, the gears in Ed's head turning as he's processing this really complex and, uh, you know, convoluted situation that he's in. <laughs> and then out of nowhere, uh, Al just whoosh, through the door. <laughs> Bam. No thinking anymore. Really, that's a nice little, uh, you, you you can call it intentional, I guess. Where you're just like, no, I, he is literally snapping him out of that mindset, right? That's not good. But they already decided that's not right. I guess if they're trying to frame her, though, they might expedite the process. What about Rinu? She wasn't there. She has nothing to do with this. Did they just leave without telling her? Is that what it is? Hmm. No, he's not. Nah, he's a liar. I don't trust that guy. I don't trust anything he says. Wait, 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 wait. Are they... Are they infiltrating? Are they trying to break her out? Or break him out? Sorry. It's the ninjas, right? No, it's him. Okay. What is he up to? I thought it was the prince's ninja friends that were going to save him. Nope. Hmm. Well, he's not. I have questions. I have so many questions. Yeah, he's not allowed. Hmm. Don't let him out of there. <laughs> nice going. Great place to come to. Oh. The east. That was instant. What was that about? Does he have ties to the east? I don't remember. I don't think he does. I can't, I can't think of anything. That was kind of out of nowhere. Why was that the reason that he let him out? Uh-oh. I feel like breaking her out of prison is perhaps not the best way to handle the situation. <laughs> this is not the high honey that we, uh, that we crave. <laughs> Where the the bars just disappeared completely. Oh, no, he opened the door. Okay, never mind. 
<laughs> the bars are in the background here. He just opened it. I didn't realize they would swing out like that. Okay. I can totally see that. I assumed he was just going to bust his way through, though. Yeah. Wait, how does he know he was... That's very convenient. Uh-huh. They're not going to do a proper investigation. Yeah, why is he trying to save her? Other than that, I just assumed he was told to. No, you don't have any other choice. Little does she know, though, she, he, he's working with Roy. <laughs> Presumably, or for them. Today is not the day to have a moral quandary. You're going to be sacrificed, so you kind of have to run away. Would you rather become a fugitive or die for nothing? You know? There you go. Ugh. Fucking hate that guy's face so much. Mm. It's only going to make her more of a target, though. And even even without... Even without her, like, in the picture... You know, she'll still become a symbol. It still works out in their favor, because... She is still the person who has all the blame on her, right? So regardless of whether she lives or dies, she is still the scapegoat. So I guess, I guess to a degree, it doesn't matter. Because no one's really going to believe her anyway other than the people that already believe her. So she's kind of screwed either way. Yeah, Roy is in on this. Roy's got to know what's going on, right? Oh, shit. Okay. Hey, what's up, guys? Random as hell. Hey, <laughs> it's the Spider-Man meme. It's the Spider-Man meme. <laughs> you're, you're me. Yeah, why is he here? That guy just doesn't disappear. I have a bad feeling about that. Hey, they're not fighting you. Yeah. He's right. She's got to get out of there. He doesn't know if these two are going to turn her in or not. Whatever the plan was to get her to safety, like, she, they just have to keep following it. And now aren't a part of it, so, like, spending too much time on it will really just make things worse for her. Yep. Yep. Oh, shit. Yeah, he's faking it, though. Remember, that's why it said that they had authority to shoot to kill, right? And as soon as it said that, it cut to Roy. So, whether he's actually killing her or not, I'm just going to predict that he's just pretending to kill her to get her out of there. Right? So that he can make himself look good, too. So he, he could be like, oh, I'm the, I'm the one who killed the traitor. It was me. That's my guess, anyway. I could be wrong. Maybe he did just end her, but I don't think so. I think this is all part of his plan. I still don't know, though. I watched it happen, and I don't know. Oh, shit. Wait. Does he have a fake body, or is that really her? I think my, my theory still could be intact. Which is crazy enough to think. I think it's a fake body. I think he puts the tags on her. They switch out the tags. And she's safe somewhere. Mmm, Henry Douglas. Fuck that guy. Roy Mustang. My guy. He uh, Ed can't know for now. I don't think he's going to tell him. I swear I'm still right, though. 
She didn't do it. Damn. What is going on? Yeah. See, this kind of leans in with my theory that he's try just trying to keep up appearances. You know what I mean? I think that's all this is. Because we've already seen that Roy won't tell Ed everything that he needs to know if he doesn't think that it's, like, beneficial to the general overall cause, right? So, I think he's just keeping him in the dark on purpose. I don't think he did. I don't think he did. I think this is all part of his plan. Mm-hmm. That's what I said. It'll all look kind of stupid if it turns out he just straight up killed her. <laughs> Maybe he decided that that was better because that would be the number one way to make sure that she doesn't, like, continue to be a problem. But clearly, 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 they use the, the what's this guy? I, I can't remember his name why am i forgetting the butcher guy clearly they used the butcher guy to funnel her here for this specific reason right whether he actually killed her or if he actually saved her and just pretended to kill her right clearly he wanted her to be brought to him yeah this is what he needs them to be right now he needs them to just listen to him It's all according to plan. All her appearances. He was a good guy. <laughs> no, it wasn't. It was another known criminal. Nah. Crazy that this guy is assuming that. I mean, it is something Roy would do, but no. None of the people... This is why Roy used the butcher guy. <laughs> so it wouldn't be able to be traced back to him. Yeah, I'd appreciate it if you avoided such speculation, even though it's completely true. Yeah, he wanted to. He wanted to. No, it's not. Ed thinks everything is his fault. It's not your fault, man. Just one of those things you gotta learn as you get older. Hmm. Okay. Is he on the conspiracy too? That's not appropriate to comment on her beauty. Who cares? Ah, oh, poor thing. This dead girl was hot. Who cares? Shut up. <laughs> Maybe the fact that she's dead is what's important here. That sucks. He just did what he does. He's in on it. No one glances. <laughs> the hero of the Ishval War? You mean the genocide? I don't know that I like that. I don't know that I like that for Roy. Important. Yeah, well. She didn't. Does he know? I kind of get the feeling that he doesn't know. That he actually believes that she did it. Because he's acting like he did it. I don't think Alex. Or she did it, I mean. I don't think Alex is the type of person who could fake this shit. Huh. What does that mean? 
Oh, hell yeah. I want to go. <laughs> I feel like there might be a specific reason he wants to remove Alex from the situation. I know it's just a suggestion and he was not like an ordering, you know, ordering him to do it or anything. There's got to be something there. It's a very convenient way to wrap this up, right? So that's why I still kind of believe that he didn't actually kill her. <laughs> because it, it does come up really, it, it really, even these people are believing it. Yeah. It's an act of defiance on Roy's part. Mm. I don't know. I think I'm with Lust here. I don't think that it, it went the way that they wanted it to. Hmm. Oh, wow, okay. <laughs> I guess it's pretty convenient when he can just do that whenever he wants. <laughs> He's the one who gets to approve his own team's vacation requests. Yep, 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 yep. All according to plan. He has some plan. He has a plan. It was the colonel's idea. True. It was all the plan. That's funny. Yo! <laughs> Why did he bring this guy out? I don't know why he grabbed this guy. Yeah, I was going to say, there's no way those people that won't be able to track him down. Ninjas know where he is. Ninjas will know what that fire means, too. Who's Elizabeth? Yeah, Reese is out. On purpose. It's code. It's Maria. It's all according to plan. <laughs> is there some reason that he wants all these people to think that Riza is, has this effect on him? I wonder what this is about. I'm going to you. Code. Code. All according to plan. Hey, I've seen this shot before. <laughs> From the other episode, just without Winry. Oh, shit. What was that for? Ed had nothing to do with this. Did he find out that Maria didn't do it? And that Ed knew he didn't do it? She didn't do it? God damn it. What's going on? Oh. We'll have to repair this at once. Okay. It seems like... Is he working with Roy? Are they removing everybody important from the military by having them all go and leave at the same time? Is that what they're doing? Oh no, you're going to have to leave in order to get your thing repaired. Yeah, see, they're all meeting up. This is all according to plan. So does that mean that Alex was in on it as well? Alex has to be in him now. Maybe I was wrong about him not being able to act. He's so genuine. Hmm. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Why does Ed get to go, but Al doesn't? I guess Al is not technically part of the military, right? He, he tags along with Ed, but Ed is the one who is the actual uh whatever it's called state whatever state alchemist <laughs> how can i forget the word alchemist yeah this is all according to plan yep their orders i knew it i told you i called every single bit of this i was all over this yeah so alex is working for roy now okay all according to Kikaku. Yeah, what is he going to do? He removed everybody that he cared about. Everybody who's relevant. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
Yeah. Who knows? Chances are pretty good. Yeah. That's too bad. For them, I mean, good for us that they don't know where he is. <laughs> There's only one of you. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I don't like that. What? Huh? I thought we were already dealing with Barry Chopper. Who the hell is that? I'm scared. Alright. <laughs> A lot of thoughts in that episode. A lot of thoughts. Let's go talk about them now. All right, I'm still like, I don't know what the percentage, I was about to say like X percentage amount sure that Maria is still alive and that this was all part of Roy's plan. I still would believe it if that were to happen. I'm kind of surprised. I figured the episode would end, like if that was the case, the episode would end with that as a reveal. It's interesting if they like actually did do that where like she's still alive, but they don't tell you right away. That would be fascinating. Ultimately though, I don't, I don't think it makes a huge difference whether or not she's actually dead because she's not super important. And like I said before, the idea was that she was just the scapegoat right the message to be sent to roy and roy received it <laughs> he received it he used her situation as a way to like further endear himself to the military and to keep his appearance up right clearly everything that he's doing is very calculated right now so considering last episode and how it seemed like we were just losing battles over and over again right and that our guys were just behind the ball completely this episode seems like roy actually has a full complete plan in mind and that we're going to be seeing it come together. So I'm excited about that. I'm excited about everything. I'm always excited. The show is great. I'm having a really good time. But anyway, we'll see if she's dead. Please don't tell me. I don't want to know. <laughs> I will find out in time. Just let me figure it out for myself. So yeah, don't don't tell me that in comments. But you can comment other things. Comment things that are not spoilers. Just thoughts on my thoughts. I'd appreciate it a lot. And also hit the like button, the subscribe button, the bell. I guess the bell is a button, but no one says the bell button. It doesn't sound right. It's just a bell. Just hit the bell. Just ring it. Rang that thing. Anyway, <laughs> I'll be back very soon. I'm looking forward to watching more. All right, thank you. That being said, good night, sweet princedom.